It was the first time probably I understand, understood what trauma meant. My father taught in a school next door and very often, hmm? uh, Raisina, it was just next, Raisina Bengali school. So very often uh, we as children used to go and play there and after playing take prashad from the pandit like millions of children do all over the country. We all go to play and we take the prashad from Panditji uh, after playing and we go back and we used, I knew every nook and corner. I remember one day I saw this uh, white couple uh, arguing with their guide. The guide was telling them, this is the biggest uh, temple, the most beautiful temple that we have over here. So, and they were consulting their books and saying, but this is a very new temple. It was made in 1939. We want to show some more beautiful, older temples like the way we saw in South India. So, and the guide said, no, we don't uh, have any. And there is one temple called Yogmaya, which is a very small temple. So, then they said that you are, Delhi was a Hindu city, right? We have seen mosques which are few hundred years old. For example, Jama Masjid is almost 300 years old. We have seen other mosques, Sunahari Masjid, this Masjid, but we don't see any medieval temples. So, does it mean that Hindus did not create any, build any medieval temples? So, the guide said, yes, probably not. For centuries, we did not build any big temple. The temples were small because there was a rule that the spire of a temple should not be seen, right? Then they asked, and I still remember, then you mean to say that you were second class citizens in your own country, right? How did you feel that, I mean, he, I, I, I don't know who asked, the man or the woman, but how did you feel when you would go out and you see that you have no temples of your own, when others had their big temples? How did you, how do you think the people must have felt then? The guide said, I can't answer that. So they went away. I, I don't recall what happened afterwards. They got up, they walked away. But this, I discussed with my father. My father was a school teacher and he said, we don't talk about such things. Don't talk about this, right? So I said, Baba, is it true that uh, we did not build any big, large temple for almost uh, 800, 900 years because they must have, people must have been scared that if they built it, it would, no. He said, yeah, probably not. But he said, don't talk about this, don't discuss this with anyone. And I was surprised that why we are even, why we are even so scared right now? When I grew up, this issue never left me. I asked, a friend of mine, uh, he is a professor, that what do you think, why in 1939 the first big temple was built? And he said it was probably because of the nationalism, the feeling of nationalism that gave the courage to the Hindus to build a temple. And then he said, I have heard that the architects, the architect who built it cried with joy when they realized that they were building a massive temple again after a period of many centuries.